welcome and welcome back to our channel the big king family today i will be coming to you with a huge dollar tree haul so i'm just gonna get right into it i got my drink this, this is a sun drop this is a diet sun drop <laughs> don't too many people like that one but i, I mean i just don't see too many people haul them but i got it it's good and i'm sitting here i'm ready to do this i found a lot of stuff that i've been wanting to find at dollar tree so let's get right into the haul all right, first thing first is this is laying on the table. So I'm gonna have to grab it from there. The stand up dustpan. Yes, it's a barcode right here. And there is a barcode right there, which means um, I have to pay separate for each piece. I do not care. $2.50 for a stand up dustpan. You can't beat it. And the stem is like, oh, I gotta, I gotta grab this anyway. But this stem is really long. You can, you can hang it because it's got that hole right there. The stem is super long. No more back breaking for me. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. I lay it down there. And I'm just going to go through the bags. Okay, I did get two of these. I will be organizing my spices with these. I got like a small spice cabinet. And I'm just going to layer them up so I can at least see everything. If I can see everything, I think I'm good to go. So that's how I'm going to do that with my spices. Just for right now, a very inexpensive um, organizational hack right there. They're not that sturdy or nothing like that, but I wonder if there are any ways to help make those a little more sturdier. You know, I'm going to watch some videos. I'm sure there are. Okay. Um, I did get this index box card holder. I got the teal kind. As you guys saw in my walkthrough, my Dollar Tree walkthrough, I said I was going to get doodle bucks, some, uh, what you call it, some flash cards. And then as they build up, you know, as they build up, I will um, store them in this. And I picked the teal color. I think that's so pretty. It's green. Okay, color. and I'm back. I feel like I got a lot of items. As you guys know, who came up here and interrupted my haul? Doodle bug came up here, but okay, I see the flashcards in here. Okay, I did get so these are flashcards for A Apple. So these are for your letters for the alphabet, and uh, it's gonna show a letter, I guess, and a picture of of a you know an item that starts with the letter A. He don't want to go to bed, you guys. It's really late at night when I'm doing this all. He don't want to go to bed. Okay, and I also got the first words like. Box, and I guess they're gonna show some different items that he could be saying his first words with. Uh, Dunaba is slightly, he don't have as many words. He's not speaking as many words as he should be speaking right now. And this should help a lot. Showing him this, reiterating it until he get these down packed. Once he get these down packed, I'm gonna grab two more packs each and every time and then go through the whole pack at one time sometimes. Um, other than that, I really want him to learn what different things are. Um, he's four years old though, so you know, I'm not rolling too bad for him, but we're gonna really be working with these flashcards. And as I said, I got the index card holder to hold all the flashcards. I really wanna be like a little teacher, almost in-home parent, in, in parent teacher. I wanna get me an easel, and I would like to get that pointer from Dollar Tree, and um, yeah, do some different things. Like this is a fire truck. Um, go pick up the color, the red color, the red crayon and color the fire truck and i probably have a fire truck and an ambulance truck there coloring paper you can print them off on your print for free i probably have an ambulance truck and a fire truck paint uh color the fire truck red you know just different stuff like that to kind of help him engage and be more just being more productive learning different things okay i'm not gonna stay on that long i'm, I'm really gonna be like <laughs> very excited about that mode of my motherhood um got two of these these are the airwick brown brown sugar and vanilla brown sugar and vanilla airwicks um the regular airwicks that you buy at the store they're a little bigger than this they be they probably gonna last you about three to four weeks these probably just last right at two weeks maybe 10 days to two weeks that's what I've, I've, I've come to find out. But I love them for $1.25 every week. Oh, and when they were just a dollar, man, that's excellent, excellent deal. Because these things can be upwards of $4 and $5 a piece. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put those down. I got two of those brown. What is it? Brown sugar and vanilla. That's going to smell good. I need to just stop out on these. This is a gray dish towel. Gray dish towel. Um, I'm going to put this in my kitchen. I'm probably going to hang it on the back of a cabinet with a command hook. You know, so that I won't, you know, so they won't be all over the place. I just want it behind a cabinet. So I got one um, 
hand towel. We use this to dry dishes with um, in case they're not inside the dishwasher drying. Okay, let me keep on moving. I'll just show it anyway. I found another pack of the sweet tea. Another pack of the Lipton sweet tea. This is a packet of sweet tea. And what you're going to do with it, you just add water. When you just add water, put it in there to get good and cold. And you got yourself some delicious tea. I don't know how they even out the measurements or whatnot, but we had this for Easter, uh, for that, that Easter brunch I did. And delicious. You just put it with water, stir, and serve. Uh, that's my kind of stuff right there. Uh, one and done. Add that water and serve. One and done. Those are excellent, you guys. But it only makes like... It, it, it definitely doesn't make no more than a half a gallon of tea. No more than a half a gallon. So you're going to need probably two packs in order to make a full gallon. That should be about the equi equivalent of a full gallon. Uh, TB gave me uh, the ups that we needed more butter knives. So I got this. This be a two pack at Dollar Tree. Two for $1.25, which I think they're two for a dollar at Walmart. But I have to go with what I know or go with where I'm at. Um, by the time I got to Walmart, I may well forget we even need them. So I got two more butter knives. Uh, we just use butter knives, knives. They come in handy for some of everything, especially when it comes to unlocking those. So <laughs> it is what it is. Yes, we like to have a couple of those around. I did get the dark brown coloring from from the Dollar Tree, Dollar Twenty Five Tree. This is another item I want to stop pile on because I do I do dye my hair. Uh, sometimes I get in that phase where I won't dye my hair for six months to a year, and then sometimes and then I turn around and start back dyeing my hair. So two things I really want to stop how on will be the uh, drying dish towels and the hair color. You know, it's just certain stuff that I know I want to get a lot of from Dollar Tree. And I feel like it would be, it's just a really good deal. And also, I just haven't even seen this in the store. I see it in the canisters, but not in the store. I want to stop how this also, you know, there's just certain things I really want to load up on and put into my pepper pantry. Stop pile. Got these socks right here for Deucey. These are those right there with the little rib right here. The little rib right here. He said they're thin, but he kind of liked that because it helps keep his feet cool while he's at work. He go and do about two or three hours uh, when he do go to work in the day. So, you know, he really uh, likes these. They, they're just cool. Uh, oh, they're so soft too. So soft. This is the juncture kind. Athletic juncture kind right here. And they're real thin, but if you're going to be standing all, all day and your feet's going to get kind of sweaty and stuff, this would be good to have. Instead of the real thicker ones. Okay, moving on. This is something I've been wanting to find at Dollar Tree that I haven't been able to find at Dollar Tree. I've been wanting to find this. That. The uh, multi-purpose cleaner. Love that. Kills 99.9% .9 of germs. All I have to do is to add a spray spout. And I'm going to use it. I know it's going to be pretty good. It's by Windex. This is something else. I really like to stop power on. I like to keep probably six to eight cleaners at a time. And I, I do have that amount right now. So that is such a blessing to have the amount that you want in your stop power. I don't really have to buy anymore. So I'll just add this to those cleaners. I don't really have to stop power because I already have quite a few cleaners. Let's think about that. And speaking of cleaners, this makes about seven or eight, these next two that I add. Uh, I'm going to try this. Not even going to try to pronounce that. But if somebody in the comments, they may let me know how to pronounce it. They may, hopefully. And, I'm 30, and you get 33% more free on this bottle right here. And this is a multi-purpose cleaner. I can't really even see on this. I hope it'd be pretty good, you guys. I hope it'd be pretty darn good. Dollar twenty-five, pretty big, pretty big cleaner too. It's like a big, and it, it don't say it kills the germs and stuff. But I'm sure it smells real good and it just cleans. So I just really want to get that. Okay, moving on. Okay, I saw this right here. I asked the lady, the clerk up front, if I can have this box for the tea. You know, as I stop pile them, I have something to kind of contain it. Boop, just like that. So I will be filling this joker up. How they normally they had a lot of lemon, but they only had a couple of the sweet. And I only showed one sweet, but I just haven't got to the next one. I don't know where is it right here. Yep, this is it right here. So they only had two of the sweet ones. That's it. 
two of those sweet tea just in water. I absolutely love those. I haven't even seen nobody haul those. And I wash Dollar Tree hauls all the time. I don't know if I necessarily, I'm always cleaning. I'm moving around the house and I'll put something on TV and I see a few things. I might get a couple things catching my eye, like especially, especially this Windex cleaner. I really wanted to try to find this and I'm so glad I was able to find it. So glad, cause I just really want to try that. What kind of scent is this? Yellow, but what kind of scent is it? Uh, citrus fresh scent. Citrus, if y'all can see that. I don't know. Citrus fresh scent. So yeah, citrus fresh scent. I can't never find one. Do red. I can't never really find a black one either. So this is like a a goldish looking color. A do red. I really need this. I want to start wrapping my hair back up, like wrapping it and bringing it down every night. So tonight I'll probably try to wrap my hair. I'll try, I'm getting it as straight as I can. While converting to natural, it really stuck pretty hard. Man, I did that one perm and I've had to flat iron it three times since I did that one perm, trying to get it back bone straight like I used to have it. And whoa, yeah, it's giving me a run for my money to get it bone straight, get it back, you know, as straight as it was. Um, I am going to try this and I mean, it smells so good. The bars are 4.12 ounce bars, 4.12 ounce bars. That's way bigger than your average, your average bar in Dollar Tree is probably no more than three ounces. This is 4.12. So that is awesome. Yep, 20% bonus size. This is your zest and it's, it's your um, lush orchard and almond oil. And I know that soap's gonna smell so good. So I'm gonna try it. It only comes with two bars, you know. Most of the time Dollar Tree soaps don't have nothing but two bars, you know. But you're getting a lot more right there. So that is awesome, awesome, awesome. Speaking of bar soap, speaking of bar soap, let's do this. Speaking of bar soap. Look what I found. Bam. I found this Irish Spring antibacterial soap. It do say sports strength right there. But guess what? Oh, it already said right there. Three bars. Three bars. Three bars is in here. I cannot believe this right here would be four or five dollars in a regular store. Sometimes upwards of six dollars. And the bars are 3.7 ounces. Not three ounces, but they're three point seven ounces it's just a regular size i hope i can get it to show 3.7 ounces regular size name brand item regular size name brand item regular size name brand item that's what i like to see we can always find the kind of smaller one name brand items. And don't get me wrong, when it, when you're in a tight and you need it, go to Dollar Tree. I tried to find something to rhyme with that. When you need to see, go to Dollar Tree. That don't really sound like, you know, what I'm trying to talk about. But anyway, <laughs> when you really need it, go to Dollar Tree, of course. But, man, when you go there and you can find those, that's, I think that's my kicker of Dollar Tree is finding name brand items at the full size. Full size name brand items is what I love to see at Dollar Tree. I just absolutely love to see it. So now I didn't I didn't only get one. I got two, three, dollar twenty-five, four. A lot of time when you're a coupon, you can't even get the three count soaps down to a dollar twenty five because something got so expensive and for some reason do the book open one of mine five there was seven in that little bin but i got five so i said let me just leave one you know so i got those kind of stuff i mean i am truly stocked up on this bar soap stuff so i don't know yes lord yes lord i did get my oldie but goodie right here oldie but goodie the dove Oldie but goodie, see the Oh, okay, for once I'm doing something and my hands are not ashy. Plus, I just did my little nails. Yeah, I just did my nail ways. I'm gonna throw them up. But you know, these right here are a little long for my taste. They long for my taste. I am, 
I am I have filed them down some and and anyway, these press on nails, you're gonna have to, you're gonna file them down and kind of get them rounded a little bit. So they'll just scratch the heck out of you. So you gotta round them down. Um, I plan on, I'm not no expert at cutting them down, but I hear a lot of young ladies, are uh, a few, there's a few. I don't know how they have time to watch TV, but when I am watching a YouTuber on um, the health and hygiene stuff, um, they say they cut theirs down and I don't know. My will probably gonna look a mess. So I'm gonna keep on just kinda filing them and, and rounding them up, filing them, rounding them up. They were longer than this, you guys. They were longer than I thought they were, but I thought they were so pretty. I don't know if you can see them really good, like. I don't know. Yeah, you probably can see them, but like, you know, not a whole lot, but still real pretty. I thought they were so pretty, so gorgeous. Um, they're the class, the classy line by Kiss. It's classy line, classy. So I do love my French tips. That's about all I normally wear. But this is with a little oomph on it, you know. So I did get my my Dove cream to drop off into my purse. And this this kind of smells so good. It to me, I prefer it over the white and blue one. But I'll take the white and blue one if that's all they got. So yeah, I got one. Sure did. Everything empty down here. Nope. Okay, Clarissa. That is one of my YouTube daughters niece family friend my sister and my friend you know but i said daughter because she's really young uh, i believe she is and uh yeah i got the hundred sheet patty the patty paper um what i'm gonna use these for is that i have sliced cheese and the kroger sliced cheese and the shredded cheese and that little block cheese like i think it's eight ounce it go on sale for like a dollar 29 all the time it go on sale go on sale and sometimes they give they gave me for like I know a good five to six weeks straight, they gave me a free slice Kroger cheese coupon. I know y'all remember when I was getting that free cheese, and I, I would tell them when I did a coupon haul. And uh, when I freeze it, take it out and throw it. Man, it's up. You got to just crumble it up and use it. Or you got to just melt it and use it because it would not come apart, right? So I learned to probably take it out the package. I'm gonna put in zip bags and in, and last time what I did, I put a piece of foil in between each one, but uh, the foil seemed to stick a little, but I still was able to get it all off and use that cheese. But this right here, I think this gonna work right here. Wait a second, it said great for, look, 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 look at that, look at that. Great for cold cuts, sliced cheese, and so on and so on. I'm gonna read it off to you. Uh, frozen steaks, chocolates, caramel, taffy and more and i just did those chicken wings and these are not that big though but maybe if i did no i'd have to find some bigger ones like this to kind of put between my ziploc bags i was talking to my mother-in-law mama angie about um the uh stacking of the chicken she said it will kind of stick if you just stack them in there like that a little damp they're gonna stick so i didn't even think about that i bet they kind of stuck but what i do i took some warm water and slim that on part you know this time, but I'm gonna have to find something. Oh, parchment paper might will do it when you're stacking your meats, you know. But anyway, yeah, and it's a hundred in them, one hundred. So I mean, this will last me for a while. I should be so excited when I learn new things. I just feel excited to see this too. Um, I also got this right here. This is your healthy choice chicken noodle. Healthy Choice Chicken Noodle Soup. It's the 15 ounce can. Regular size can, name brand regular size, you know. Hope it tastes pretty good. But I think if I did, mm, you know, I, don't, I ain't probably add too much more sodium to it, but I will season it up if I have to to make the taste work done, but I don't know. I don't know how it tastes. It might be pretty good, you know. I like kind of light stuff, it don't bother me. And you know something I can eat? I can eat saltine crackers, beef broth, turkey broth, um, chicken broth you just warm it up and get you some saltine crackers and that's a meal i'm telling you i don't know why i can do that and it's filling but i want to stop piling on some soups and most soups sometimes could be in upwards of three and four dollars a can they're a little bigger than this but i'd rather pay a dollar 25 instead of three dollars a can so i'm gonna see if how this do what it do i gotta hide it from my daughter Cindy. she just had a birthday but she really loved the soups if she see this one in there she'll get it and use it you know? eat it up i mean so uh uh um this right here is your signature spray 
uh, just by me spraying, I don't know why I went ahead and got it, but just by me spraying it in the store, you know. This one right here is your lavender field scent, okay? This the best smelling one. I, I smell the strongest smelling one. You know, sometimes, sometimes Dollar Tree be doing way too much there. Yeah, this was the best smelling one. It smells pretty good to me. This was the best smelling one. It's your lavender fields lumen essence scent. You probably can't even see that. I might take a picture of it and put it. No, I probably won't. But it's your signature lumen essence scent. It's just a small bottle. You can have it in your purse or whatnot. But what me and my husband use it for, like if we pass gas or something, he be like, you got to spray in your purse. I'll be like, I got to spray my purse, baby. Or else, even me, even Tibby, all of us, we got our little spray. She got a little bath and body work one, but okay. this right here will do. Just anything, kind of ease everything down and not to offend others. All right. Y'all, we are not through yet. We are not through yet. I had, I had a lot of stuff from Dollar Tree, y'all. I'm doing too. i just doing too much. I'm trying to check out all my bag stuff to make sure they're empty. But we're going to go ahead and get into this right here. Um, this is some of their edge control. It is not the absolute best. All right, you guys. We're down to the last little bit of it. I got these right here. These right here. And I do, I actually, right here, they're shown in between a set of uh, your cast iron skillets. I actually have a set of cast iron skillets and I'm gonna put these right in between them, you know, just just to do it. They were $1.25, why not? I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Uh, I don't know to help prevent, what, pot and pan protectors. Okay, can I tell me what it actually does? No, nope, no, 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 no. Don't really tell you. Mm -hmm. So I was hoping it would help with rusting, but I really, uh, what we do is put a little bit of oil on our pans after we clean them dry them down real good and a little bit of oil across there you know in oil we have an oil towel a towel that's been oiled that we've got to rub across there and we've been having them for about three years now this is about the third year we've had our cast iron skillet set that will do the trick after you clean them and dry them well go ahead a little towel with a little oil on it just go around the whole pan with it and that'll be that okay but i got these to put in between I'm going to see how that goes with the cast iron pans. I also, and some people just told me, a lady was in there and saw me looking at them. She said she just put paper towels in between her cast iron pans. So you ain't even got to just do all that. But I just got those. I thought it would be a great addition to the kitchen um, organization, you know, I guess. To the kitchen organization I've been doing here lately. I did get edge wax, the edge wax. And this is your watermelon kind. They have so many different kinds. I know I got, I got the lemon and the strawberry and watermelon, you know, and um, I'm definitely gonna stockpile on these. They will, they, it, it does make your edges a little white, but this will work when you don't have your edge fixer. When you don't have that stuff, that's a little more about three times the price, you know, um, that will do, that will do, it'll do. That'll do. I wanted to show you guys some juices that I had picked up. I had picked up, this is the pomegranate blueberry acai e healthy balance pomegranate old orchard. Uh, this is 64 fluid ounce, isn't it? Sure is. Name brand item, regular size, you know, regular size name brand item. I'm gonna try some of these. I'm just gonna try some of them. The sugar, carbs, and calories is so much lower in these juices. So I'm gonna try some of them, and if I like them, I will stop on these. Also, um, all while trying to watch these dates. Yeah, this. These are all January, February, and March 2024. Way next year, and we are some drinkers in this house. I like that we, we got we got to keep a lot to drink. I literally have a drink cabinet. That's how much drink we drink all the time around here. We be drinking different drinks and stuff. So this will not last till next year, 2024. But I, ooh, for that 25, this big nice jug is, that's awesome. So this one right here is the pomegranate blueberry acai. I also got the, the white grape peach, the white grape peach, white grape peach. I don't know about that one, but I'm gonna see. I, this one right here is your mango tangerine your mango tangerine one all righty man the carbs and the sugar is so low on this um and then i got the apple 
cranberry, the apple cranberry one. Okay. Any, mini money mo, catch a tiger by his toe. If it hollow, let him go. Any, mini money mo. So the first one I will be trying will be the white grape peach. The white grape peach is what I'm gonna try first. I'm gonna put this bad boy in the refrigerator tonight so we can try it. Okay. Um, just a few more eyes, you guys. This is a big one here, and I, I'm just. I love the Dollar Tree. I do. Full. Full size. I'm gonna forget what I'm gonna say. Full size name brand items, and you know I had to hit the clearance. I had to hit it. I had to hit it. I had to hit it for some reason. These were here were only uh, 75 cent, 75 cent for your eight pack of uh, fruit snacks. The kids love fruit snacks. I just think, you know, I know they run through these, you know. The adults and the children like these. So, 75 cents, what the heck. I'm going to have to look in there, too. I, I think I think the box is just torn. I don't think none of them are missing in there. Don't think so. What? See, I did these trips on three different occasions. And I had already bought a do-rag. But that's all right. I can stop piling on it. Somebody said they need one, so I'm to get to them. It don't even matter. Oh, my Lord. And this is a black. I'm always talking about they don't never have the black one. And when they had this black one right here, I should have got two or three of them. I don't know what I was thinking. This was, I did not know I had already got one. Oh, there I go. But when you have more than enough, you know, it's a blessing. You don't have to really just rip around. And lo and behold, Carissa, you know they're you know they going to have them. You're going to have them half open zip bags. They're going to have them zip back. And these were only uh, 75 cents, 50 cents off that down 25 price. And you get it in here. I should have 17. And this was the, is it a sandwich bag? Okay, fine, extendable and all that zip lock and stuff. You see right there, it's the kind that kind of can stand up, you know. Those are more you could fill them up more you know when they kind of stand up like that zip lock we were just using for the kids snacks or something you know but you never know you never know and i did get another one that's just 75 cent also 75 cent um these are sandwich these are sandwich bags yeah this that fold ah. i don't know why i don't too much care for the fold top but this is the fold top sandwich bag it's got 150 of them in there though all right, that'll do for 75 cents. That will do. And last but not least for 75 cents. I didn't even realize what I was getting. These are the snack zipper bags. 50 of them in there. Snack zipper ones. Okay, not bad at all for 75 cents. That will do. You guys, that is our Dollar Tree. That's my Dollar Tree haul. Everything we can use and definitely need around the house. And a lot of them will stop how long. I'm just going to get a lot of... Cause you never know when Dollar Tree gonna end up being two dollar tree. So I'll need to try to, um, you know, do a little bit of stocking up. You know, definitely don't overcrowd my house, but whatever I can fit in here, I'm gonna fit it in here. And I'm, I'm so thankful, so thankful to the Lord for all He's doing for me and for the channel. Thank you, anybody who has newly subscribed in the past three months, because it has really been a surge in the past three months on our channel. I'm thank thankful to God for that. Thank you guys for joining me. Thank you for listening. And until next time, YouTube, stay blessed.